Welcome to the third conditional with TESOL Fran. I want to tell you about yesterday. Yesterday I went to the gym from uh, 10 o'clock in the morning until 1 o'clock and my husband Simon came home at 12 o'clock until 12.45. I arrived home at 1 o'clock and he left at 12.45. I didn't see him. If I'd come home early, I'd have seen him. If I'd come home early, I'd have seen him. What time did he leave? 12.45. What time did I arrive? One o'clock. Did I see him? No. Why? I was too late. If I'd come home early, I'd have seen him. If I'd come home early, I'd have seen Sai. If I had come home early, I'd have seen Sai. If I had, if I'd come home early, I would, I'd have seen Sai. Let's try just the first part. If I'd come home early, if I'd come home early, if I'd come home early, and the second part, I'd have seen Sai. I would have, I'd have, I'd have seen Sai. I'd have seen Sai. I'd have seen Sai. I'd have seen Sai. If I'd come home early, I'd have seen Sai. It's long. If I'd come home early, I'd have seen Sai. Let's take a look. So the third conditional. If I had come home early, I would have seen Sai. Is it real or not? No, it's imaginary. And is it an imaginary situation in the past, the present or the future? It's in the past. And how many verbs are there? If I had seen... Sorry. <laughs> if I had come home early, I'd have seen Sai. So there are two. So, I was at the gym from 10 till 1 and Sai was at home from 12 till 12.45. Did I see him? No. If I'd come home early, I'd have seen Sai. How do we write it? If. And here's the subject and had. And this one is the past participle. And this one, subject, would. have infinitive of have and this one past participle watch the video again and we can practice in the lesson Thank you.